Rashtrapati Bhavan for the award-giving ceremony of the Gandhi Peace Prize, which will be awarded to ISRO. President Pradab Mukherjee there. Thank you. I now request Sri A.S. Kiran Kumar, Chairman ISRO, to give the acceptance speech. Honorable President of India, Honorable Vice President, Honorable Prime Ministers, and all the dignitaries who are present here. It's indeed a matter of great honor and privilege to receive this prestigious award on behalf of the Indian Space Research Organization. We deem it a great honor bestowed by the country on the organization for the pioneering work of harnessing space technology for the development of our beloved country and contributing to the improvement in quality of life of our countrymen. This is a befitting recognition of the visionary work of Dr. Vikram Sarabhai and the successive leaders of this organization, Professor M. G. K. Menon, Professor Satish Dhawan, Professor U. R. Rao, Dr. Kasturi Rangan, Madhavan Nair, Dr. Radha Krishnan, and the untiring efforts of more than 25,000 people over five decades in developing this space technology and its tool for the benefit of our country. It's indeed a matter of great privilege to understand that we had people like Dr. Vikram Sarabhai, who foresaw when countries like Americans and Russians were looking at how this new technology can be used for improving their own strengths. Here, here was a person who looked at how this new technology can be used for bringing benefits to the development of our country. And it is indeed the great vision of this personality which we have carried forward his work today. I take this opportunity to pledge and rededicate ourselves to the cause of bringing the future of this space technology to the fruits of this space technology for our country. Thank you. Thank you, Sri A.S. Kiran Kumar. May I request the President of India, Sri Pranam Mukherjee, to address this August gathering? Muhammad Hamid Ansari, Vice President of India, Prime Minister Sri Narendra Modi, Justice H.L. Dattu, Chief Justice of India, Dr. Mahesh Sharma, Minister of State, Independent Charge for Culture and Tourism, Sri A.S. Kiran Kumar, Chairman Indian Space Research Organization, Distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen. I am delighted to be amongst you this evening. It's indeed appropriate that Gandhiji's Gandhi Peace Prize for 2014 is being conferred on the Indian Space Research Organization, ISRO, in recognition of its services in transforming India through the use of space technology and space-based services. The Government of India instituted the Gandhi Peace Prize in 1995 on the occasion of the 125th birth <coughs> anniversary of Mahatma Gandhi as a tribute to the father of nation and his ideal. The Gandhi Peace Prize is awarded to individuals and institutions for their contribution towards social, economic, and political transformation achieved through nonviolence and other Gandhian methods. ISRO today joins 
the ranks of other eminent institutions such as Ramakrishna Mission, the Grameen Bank of Bangladesh, Bharatiya Vidyabhavan, who have been conferred this prestigious award in recent times. ISRO has come a long way since its inception in 1969. The relevance of space research was questioned by many at the time. In the words of late Dr. A.P.J. Abdul Kalam, I quote, many individuals with myopic vision question the relevance of space activities in a newly independent nation which was finding it difficult to feed its population. Their vision was clear if Indians were to play meaningful role in the committee of nations, they must be second to none to the in application of advanced technologies to their real life problems. India's entry into the space arena was laid by the visionary scientists, Dr. Vikram Sharabhai, who foresaw the tremendous potential of space technology and its application in addressing the needs of our country's development. Countering the challenges of space resources, limited technical manpower and physical infrastructure in the early years, ISRO has today established operational space system and services attained self-reliance in development of indigenous technology and accomplished exemplary fears in space exploration. It has, at the same time, remained true to its mission of bringing space to the service of the common man. President Pranab Mukherjee, they're lauding uh, the various efforts and uh, projects that is ISRO has undertaken over the years towards the development of the nation. ISRO has been awarded with 2014's Gandhi Peace Prize. We now take you uh, live to